the body takes up all the space. Has some dark text. Centered. And a nice font. Now I'll just use the regular. Make it a nice reading size and start with the dark background. Space out the header. Same for the footer. And make the footer text a little lighter. Now for the separators, clear both. And set the height. And use the image. The top separator has some space below it. And the bottom separator has some space above it. And the content area just has the normal background. Okay, there's the three section layout. Uh, we seem to have some borders on all the images. Let's get rid of that. Image, border, none. Much better. Okay, so there's the layout classes. We made a lot of classes in the posts helper that we need to style as well. I'm not going to go through and pick them all out one by one like a sucker, so let's use some regular expressions. In a new file, paste in the HTML, and we want class, capture the name until it's done. And output a new line and the name. Okay. And there's all the classes. So now we need to get rid of everything else that isn't a class. So start of a line that's not a dot until the end of a line. Insert nothing. Okay, and all the classes are there. So we'll paste these into our style sheet, and let's get started styling. Post titles. Post titles are centered. Left aligned. 700 wide, big, bold, and need a nice font. Posts are also 700 wide and centered with some vertical space. Tabs will be white text to the left and small.
move the date down a bit, make it 60 wide with a bit of padding and gray. So this tab has a total width of 70. It's 60 wide with five padding on each side. Month, whatever, day, nothing. Well, it should be big. Comments should be the same as date. But maybe a different color. Let's actually pick a color. I'll say blue, not too bright, and not too light. Okay, that's good. Post content will be padded a bit. And let's see, the post is 700 wide, the tabs are 70 wide, and the body has a padding of 30. So 600 left. We need to move it over half the width of a tab, so 35. Black text. White background. The body has text on the left and is spaced out a bit, so it's easy to read. Tags on the left. Tags nothing. And links go on the right. Twitter share, I don't know what that is. Control panel, nothing. Comments, we'll do text on the left and the same colors as a post. Same padding as a post and space them out a bit. The name, just italic. Body, give it some space. Make the time, italic 2. And on the right, and small. Control panel, nothing. Okay, that's the end of them. Let's have a look. Okay, this is looking pretty good. We're getting there. The first thing I see wrong with this is that the post title and post body aren't aligned at all. The title's way over there on the left, and the post body has a big dent in it where the tabs are. Looks like I've also forgotten to style the links. Okay, so let's have a look at this. The title should move over the width of the tabs, which is 70, plus the body's padding, which is 15, so 85. Reflect that in the width. So the body's padding needs to be half of a tab, 35, plus 15 for spacing, so 50. Okay, that looks right. Let's fix the CSS. So title, padding to 85, and width to 615. Let's take care of the links while we're here too. A regular link, visited link, hover link, and active link. All of them will be gray, and normal text.
and on hover we'll add an underline. The comments link needs fixing too. Again, all types of link. And all white. And underline only on hover. Okay, let's go fix that body's padding. Everything stays the same except the left, which is 50. And let's have a look. Okay, good. Okay, it looks like I forgot the comment bubble image that we worked so hard on, so let's get that in there. In the comments link, we just need an image tag. Okay, let's style it. Space it out a bit and center it. Okay, it's in there. And underlines when I hover. So that's all the styles that were in the post. Let's see how the comments are doing. Okay, they're still pretty ugly. So the comments just need to mimic the post. Comment editor should look like a comment. And the comment container should be the same size as a post. Okay, looks like it's the same size, but that includes the tabs. So we need to get rid of half a tab's width on the left. So again, the body gets 50 pixels of padding. And the container gets 35. And the width goes to 615, just like a post. Okay, everything's looking good here. What's still missing from the layout is the sidebar we wanted down the right. 